Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we're going to jump back with SQLite, and we are going to talk about the cursor description attribute. So all right, let's just jump into it. So if you're new here, thanks for joining us. If you've not hit that subscribe button, go ahead and do that and hit the notification bell. So all right, in our little perfect world that we've been living in, we we've built and used so we're the we're the end user and then we're the base user we're uh we we know everything well in the real world we we don't have that luxury so right here we have our viewer and we can know that our columns are we have a table called students uh it's uh has two columns first and last well what happens if we didn't have that luxury so all right, we've here's where we were kind of left off. I've left a little bit out, but let, let's run dir on our cursor object. Now here's something that used to drive me nuts when I was learning. So these all look like methods, right? Well, that's not exactly the case. So let's look right here. Let's run help on description. Cursor description. All right. I'm sorry. Run help on cursor object. Okay. So, right here. Here are the methods. Come all the way through. Aha. Data descriptors defined here. Attributes. Okay. So, these are the ones that you do not need parentheses on so now let's say in the example that we have that you have an IP address and then the name of the database and that's it and you need to go and poke around and learn so you create a cursor object you just say hey let's just look at everything in there have my cursor object let's look and see what how it's really built Oops. Helps if you spell things correctly. Description. Too long of a word for me. Aha! Here we go. Column one, named first. Column two, named last. So that is how we do it. And we are going to now really start dipping into and <clears throat> getting fancy and learning more about the SQL language but this is a very handy and need to be known feature and attribute for the cursor object for SQLite so there we go please drop any comments questions or any video requests quests below you guys have been phenomenal with those um, really blown away so as always guys thanks for watching stay tuned and we'll see you guys next time bye guys